there's always uh, f a few of us that writes more, but we um, we always uh, arrange all the songs uh, collectively. So that's where you get everyone's input, and that makes it sound much more varied than it would be if just one person would write all the music. We've been basically working the last half year um, really hard on the album because uh, we had a little break for a while too. So um, I think it was a good thing to charge the batteries, you know, and uh, we all get together and uh, start working on the album. So. This is uh, the song called uh, the Serpentine Offering, probably the, the song with the most uh, orchestra. I think it's, it's around 24 tracks altogether. I think Eivind spent three days of work just to make this intro. Yeah, we have like strings. Same place with horns also. And same spot again. We have some percussion stuff, really cool stuff. Beautiful choirs also. So when you mix all this together, you get this lovely intro. going to be um, pretty good because Frederick and Patrick who works uh, here in the studio they're really good at coming up with ideas. Okay, this is a quick tour of the studio. Uh, we have here our bedroom, and which everybody's bunked in. It's quite crammy, especially when you are for like some time, which we have been. It's just stuff. We have an excellent bathroom here, like, but it's uh, now occupied by Mr. Chagrat. Here's our lovely kitchen. Uh, Brought our own uh, 
Xbox thing is, so we have something to do, which is nice. This is where the actual sound is uh, being recorded. Um, here we have the amp still standing. Here was the drum kit that's sold down now. And this is where I sleep. My secret lair. <coughs> I got my personal computer, stuff, books, games. That's pretty much it. So um, yeah, it's going to be good to finally have it out and start touring it. For me, to working together with him is the third album, and this time is, I think, is a mixture of uh, the Pure Technical album and the latest album we did. So it's like, I think it's a, it's, a, it's a good album, and also it's. I don't think any fans will be disappointed or something like that. It's like this is Dimi Borgi. Lay down your soul to the gods rock and roll!